Hello! Hey, it's Olivia here, um, full-time photographer. I'm just wanting to give you a little bit of information about me and why I need your help. So basically, I've just spent the last couple of years photographing 100 women uh, in Tasmania breastfeeding their babies. And as part of this, I've documented their individual journeys into motherhood. And it's going to go into a book. And the book is almost finished, but I just need your help just to get that last little bit so basically um, the reason why this project came about so it is a, a passion project for me um, I have two children Remy do you want to jump up and say hi one two three here we go here's one little rascal um, so basically when Remy was only six weeks old and you're now three um, you had a really tough time he doesn't sleep still doesn't <laughs> um, and you know, we, well me, I, I found it really, really um, hard and isolating um, to the point that I ended up um, going blind when he was six weeks old within a, like literally a few days. It just came from nowhere. Um, and that actually lasted for around I six months and it was just in one eye. And you want a no. band-aid? I'll get you one in a second. We'll go find one in a mini. Um, so yeah, that was... That was really, really hard. So I guess I found myself in that situation where I felt really alone, isolated, um, you know, I had no one, no real support close by. I lived an hour out of town on um, like a property. So I was, you know, I was really was disconnected from everything. Um, plus a new baby that doesn't sleep. And then I was breastfeeding around the clock. Um, he wouldn't take a bottle or a dummy. So anyway, you kind of understand where I'm going with it. So basically, I, I reached out to other women and wanted to hear about their stories. And as a photographer, um, I really wanted to show, you know, to catch that special bond between mother and, and baby. Um, yeah, so anyway, I, I've, I've finished the project. Um, and then I had a, an amazing gallery exhibition at the Long Gallery in earlier this year. Um, and thank you to everyone who supported that project. Like, without your help, I wouldn't have got it to where it was. So basically, to print 100 portraits at, for example, $150, and that's framed, and I'm talking cheap, um, but done really professionally, that's over $15,000, plus the exhibition space, all the other stuff. I've donated so much of my time. Um, I've done the design of the book, all the photography, and I'm in the last stages. So basically... The whole point of this particular project is it's not um, please give me your money or anything like that. It's um, This is a creative project and it's a pre-order system. So basically you get something for your money. And if you do decide you only want to do the helping hand donation, thank you, that's $25.00 every cent counts um, to get this project off the ground, printed and into the hands of other women who can pick up this book, read just a few stories at a time and actually make them feel like they're not alone and that <laughs> they can get through to the next day. And you know what, maybe maybe someone else's story is um, similar to theirs or even, even worse and makes them realise that, hey, you know what, this, this isn't so bad, you know, I can get through today, I just need that sleep or maybe um, a friend will reach out to them and go, hey, you know, she just wants a, someone to cook a lasagna tonight so then she doesn't have to do that or, you know, put a load of washing on and hang it out for her. Those little things um, make such a big difference and I think sometimes we we just get caught up in our own little world that sometimes it's um, nice to to reach out and help others. So I think from this book, if, if there's anything anyone can take away, it's, hey, you know what, this shit is hard. And, um, you know, obviously it's amazing and we wouldn't change it for the world and it's the best job. But, you know, there's tough days and sometimes it's just those people in between to help us get there. So if you want to pre-order a copy of the book, um, look, at this stage I'm literally going to print 100 books. 100 books cost over six thousand dollars if i print a thousand i'm looking at about eighteen twenty thousand dollars um that's what i'd love to do but at this stage for the first limited edition um that's kind of where we're at you know this all costs money and you know if if the first lot goes and then i can pre-order some more then it's good but anyway, thank you so much. I know I've probably spoken way too fast, um, but if you have any questions, I'm trying to think if I've got an example of the book here with me. I've got, um, 
yeah so here you get an idea there's stories I wonder if I scroll down so yeah it's really pretty it's looking really good um, it's basically you know it is finished I've just got a couple more things to do like the front cover but you know it's looking beautiful and thank you so much to all the women who've participated uh, it's been fantastic meeting you all. Oh my god, I've actually got a hot cup of tea. Mm. That is actually rare, so I should drink that. Otherwise, it will go in the microwave like ten times. Um, so yeah, just just share, please. I've got thirty days to get the last of this money together. I'm going to pre-order the book and I'm going to get it out there to all the people who've ordered it. And then, if people want to order a copy later, they can do that too. All right, thank you so much and happy parenting. All right, Mwah. amazing. Thank you. Oh, and ignore these bags under my eyes, seriously. <laughs>